What's up guys, it's Brandon Explored This and in today's video, we're at Desert Center, California. We're ready to go explore a bunch of abandoned places. Let's go explore this, guys. RV park. I see a trailer here with a no trespassing sign. Here, I don't think anybody's living in that. So that nobody's here. It's just us, but who knows? So I gotta look out for uh, snakes and animals that live in the desert, right? Old boat. This is pretty cool, right? Roger that. Uh, even the sewer is still here, guys. There's water in there. Toyota right here. Whole entire abandoned town. More homes. Originally right here, number 50, 51. Okay, since I know it's pretty chill, I'm gonna get my car rigged inside. So tune in, guys. Now we're outside the famous abandoned restaurant. This restaurant was open in the 1920s and it was actually open for 24 hours. Another store, possibly next to the cafe. This definitely was a workshop. I don't know what this is. If you guys know what this was inside the building, if it was like a, I don't know, something cool, comment and let me know. Old cash register, guys. See this old soda machine back there? That's cool. Yeah, we can't go in guys. I just drove like three hours and it's locked. Oh. This barn is locked guys. What do you guys say about that? Hello. You guys check out that sign. Fireplace in here guys. There's a cop. People coming right now look like tweakers. Back of the restaurant. There's an old soda fountain with the little ice cooler in the bottom. Some prices. Some oregano. Me and Thomas explored this abandoned uh, restaurant. They actually tore down that restaurant. You guys gotta check it out. Everything was left. Everything. It was boarded up for years. Hall oh, still. This is where the dishwashers would be. Still the sinks. manager's office. I've been a trade for six years climbing buildings. I'm Austin. I'm Brandon. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. There's like a cop right there. The highway patrol that just pulled up. I was in the building when he came by and I was like, oh. We're not allowed to explore them. Well, there's like a bunch of signs. I see like private property. He's in that building right now. Oh God. You guys can see this was a looks like a bakery or something. Still some shoes. So yeah, it looks like the whole roof completely caved in and the back of the market back there, there's still some refrigerators back there. You guys can see the refrigerators. There's still shelves on the walls. Wow, guys. They package your groceries. There's still the register. This guy's. Whoa, the floor too. Look at this. Look at the old shelves. There's still stuff on the shelves. You guys see this stuff? 
couple popcorn boxes. I won't fall through the floor, guys. Look at these shoes. A little convenient market. Still refrigerators here. Still this ice cooler. Just the back room. Look at all these uh, crates. So I wonder if anybody's uh, gotten in these from the back. Let's go explore this and check it out, guys. We'll try to break into the post office too. Like they didn't know it wasn't abandoned. The nearest gas station, 30 miles or 40 miles away and I have 39 miles to go on my gas mileage. And the cop is sitting in the abandoned, uh, there was like an abandoned gas station right there and the cops are just sitting there. The highway patrol is just sitting there, guys. So. I'm gonna backtrack a little and see maybe if we can find a gas station this way because I cannot go that way anymore, guys. I do not want to get arrested for trespassing. He saw me inside the building, guys. So I literally did a sneaky left and he knows that there's nothing this way. Literally, we're going towards the mountain, guys. I turned back around because uh, there's nowhere up here to get gas and I'm just backtracking even further, guys, and losing more gas. So I'm gonna have to pass the cop. Hopefully he's not still here. I saw like hundreds of more homes that looked abandoned, guys. Which road we're on, guys. And look, there's hundreds of homes, though. I have no gas either, guys. 36 miles. And the nearest gas station, I think, is 40. So we can't do much driving. Look at this sketch road. Oh, man. I don't like these roads. So what I'm assuming is these were cabins, guys. Can you see the number right here? 22. There's a lot more of these. Still has the wall. I would assume they all just probably had one bed. This is number 18. We're going a little lower. This old computer keyboard. This one has a bunch of office work. It's old phone. Nothing on these papers, what does it say? Look at all these uh, sets here. You guys can really tell how old this place is by all the stuff that's left. This one has a lot of clothes. Here's all the mattresses from all the cots. <laughs> We're gonna go back to the trailers and go through a lot of stuff. So we're heading back to where the cop was and we're getting closer. Still need to get gas, guys. Still need to get gas. There's a abandoned place right there. Looks like more abandoned cars. This is where the cop was at. He's over here straight ahead, guys. All right, he's gone. He's gone, guys. Texaco 24 hour service station, I guess they had out here originally. It says it's the last one left. Let's go check it out. Old these are. Wow. Pretty cool pumps. So imagine back in the day, right here, pumping your gas or getting your car work done because you popped your tire exploring an abandoned place out here. I... Now that the cops aren't here, right? We can also go inside some places. This one smells nasty. People have taken so many peas right here. Uh, I'm worried about is uh, rattlesnakes, right? There's a lot of graffiti now. This one's pretty cool, right, guys? Little Bart Simpson right there. Got a supply closet here. Let's go over there and see that other room. A lot of people see aliens out here. A lot of military bases and weird stuff going on out here. That Jesus looks cool. Close. Yeah. Oh, this one's 
smells really bad like pee. Else is camera lens. Someone just their oil or they took a pee right there. Where you used to get your air and your water. I really need a gas station right now, guys. How painted this is like there is no graffiti around here guys like look at this look how old this is this is crazy this is crazy old like Slap City or something, you know? There's like so much stuff here, guys. Hopefully nobody's here. There's that guy, though. He's walking back up. You're stealing stuff. You never know what they can do to you, right? So we gotta be on our toes. I should've bring my pepper spray from the car. 2011 license plates. A lot of stuff, right? Oh my God. I think it just went abandoned. Can you get me? It's crazy. I mean, I have friends that strip buildings their own building to make good filming. Yeah, for YouTube. Do some scenes for eight. From 93. smell of my first Acura. Electric boxes, panels. Clothes in the drawers. back to desert center and do a part two with even more places because it's starting to get dark with this old bmw that's all that's wrong with it, is the tires tire. this paperwork a car seat look at all this paper 2009 vendor vendors 2009 cash receipt Pet boys, it's probably all stolen. Oh, this one looks really old. Some stickers. That's their restroom. It's one of their rooms. I'm guessing this was like a kid's and a teenager's room. Cause those look like they'd be for teenagers. And this looks like kid wallpaper. This looks crazy hanging right here, guys. There is everything, guys. Wow. We gotta hurry up, though. You're running on a 
timely basis. I don't want to leave my car back here either, guys. There's just so much, guys. Like, snake. No, I'm just playing. That's a rope. Looks like a junkyard. Look at the windows. It doesn't open up though, guys. And I don't want to break it. I don't want to be that guy. But just look at it. Went to their church, uh, you know, retreats and going camping out here. And they probably took this and then it broke down and they had to sadly abandon it, right? This is an old motorhome. Man, this motorhome looks like a school bus. It was a school bus at one point. I can see the school. School, it says school bus on it. If you guys like this video, please make sure to drop a like and subscribe, guys. I'm out here risking my life for it all. Someone used to just sit right here. Sit right here and this was their porch. Hello. People probably wear orders. It's just a lot of stuff, guys. Everything's just left. employees only so this was probably like a scrap yard or something oh yeah you could so we gotta watch out this is very old wood guys pretty cool here's the old road signs the one way the stop sign this was on the freeway i'm pretty sure at one point make this a quick video here because uh there is a lot of um, no trespassing signs everywhere. Online is this place used to be a school. A lot of people say that this school was haunted or something. Crazy piece of art right here. Stage here. Still a chair right here that I could sit in. Pretty cool school, right? I don't know, you guys tell me. You guys think it's a pretty cool school? We're out here in the desert. So yeah, that's it of our quick exploration of the Desert Center, California, guys. We gotta get out of here, it's getting late. We need to go get gas still. Yeah, I don't think this takes gas, I think it's electric. Let's go. Make sure to drop a like and subscribe, guys. Tune in next week. I know people that try, people that don't, people that fly to the air just blow. Hopefully we make it guys. Lights on. Hopefully we make it guys. Listen. Some say you that you good, some say you doing great. Hey, I know people can't wait. They wanna hear every single thing I gotta say. Some people act cool, some act phony. People are your friends, but they never be your homies. So yeah, if you guys don't know what this is, you guys are missing out. Like extremely missing out. Snow days. So good. Oh.